Hello everybody and welcome to my quick tutorial on how you can speed up your computer's startup speed uh, and also subsequently the speed your computer runs after that. Uh, and it's a very simple and quick uh, and logical way of speeding up and it's just by changing what programs start up when you load up Windows. Uh, a lot of programs you install you don't realize actually start up and then run the entire time your computer's running. Uh, so quite often after you've had your computer for a while, that's one of the reasons that it'll be running slow, is it's just running loads of programs in the background that you're not aware of. Uh, so the way to get around this is just to click on your start menu, and in the little search bar just put MS config. Now this will load up this screen here, the system configuration, uh, and I go in and pop into this quite often, so mine's already a little bit set up, but uh, I have recently installed a few new things uh, that I need to get rid of. So first of all, uh, I would recommend going into Startup. Now this is a big list of every program that will run when you start up. Uh, and normally they'll all be ticked because they'll all be startup, uh, but you see I've got some unticked down here that I don't actually want to use. Uh, and you just go through them and any that you think you don't actually want then just get rid of so for example Microsoft OneDrive keeps popping up when I open my computer at the moment I don't want that so I'm going to untick it uh, I'd also don't want Apple Push because uh, I don't really know what it is uh, QuickTime I'm happy with but iTunes I don't want to run on startup because I don't use it every time I open my computer so why would I want to load it every time I open my computer uh, Canon, yes, uh, my monitor, yes, and my drivers for external hard drive, uh, Java platform, definitely yes, and another mon monitor driver for my second monitor. So those are the kind of things you want. Uh, and then I've got some other things, so Adobe Creative Cloud, I don't want to start when I first open, that's Photoshop and things like that. Um, NVIDIA GeForce Experience, if I need it, I'll open it. Um, that comes up with warnings about, well not warnings, but advice about how to set graphic settings on games and stuff like that. So I'll open that when I want to, I can normally figure that out myself. Um, but yeah, that's the startup, so once you've done that you press apply, uh, and it will normally ask you to restart when you press OK, but obviously I'm not going to do that because if I restart then it will stop showing you what I'm doing. Um, and then you want to go on services as well uh, and these are other things that will run uh, and you want to click on hide all Microsoft services because you want them in there um, and then as we go through uh, you just again untick anything that you don't think you want to be running so I've already got a lot of things unticked so again the graphics card uh, GeForce experience which I don't really need uh, Flash Player and Acrobat update services, which I probably could have. Uh, update services generally aren't a problem, but I'd just rather they weren't running all the time. Um, and the iPod service I don't want all the time because I don't always have my iPhone plugged in. Um, Apple OS Switch Manager is because I'm on an I iMac but got Windows installed for a boot camp, so obviously I want to keep that so that I can switch back when I need to. Um, and yeah, so once you've done that and you've restarted your computer, um, so it will say you may need to restart your computer, apply these changes before restarting, save any open files and close all programs. Uh, so I'm going to exit without a restart because I've got my recording running and it will delete my recording, which is obviously something I don't want to do because then you will never see me. Um, so yeah, uh, and that's how you can speed it up. Any questions, uh, drop them in, in the comments below. And if you have your own suggestions for how you can speed up computers, let me know and I will put a video out there. So uh, thanks for listening. Please like and subscribe and I will catch you soon.